Hi friends, in the last videos we covered what is driver, how many types of drivers are there, what is the functionality and architecture of each driver, what are various advantages and limitations of each driver, next which driver should be used, like we covered multiple videos only on types of drivers, right. Next uh, related to this driver's concept, there is one more very important entry question is there, let me talk about that. Sir, we can use some, sometimes you may hard, thin driver, even I used uh, in the last video said this word, thin, thin driver and a thick driver, are you getting right? Sir, what is the difference between thin, thin driver and a thick driver, are you getting what is the difference between thin driver, thick driver, maybe a chance to ask, what is the thin, thin, thin means what, light weighted, are you getting that light, very light component, are you getting thin, thick, what is the meaning of thick sir, thick means what, okay, heavy weight component or fatty component, are you getting that fat component, that is called thick, thick component, right, sir with respect to JDBC drivers, what is the thin driver, what is the thick driver sir, sir very, very simple, type 1, type 2, type 3 drivers are called thick drivers, Type 4 driver is called thin driver, okay, observe that, type 1, 2, 3 are called thick drivers, type 4 is called thin driver, sir, you are using the word directly 1, 2, 3 are called thick and 4 is called thin, but what is the meaning of thick driver or what is the meaning of thin driver, first observe that, sir, very simple, if the driver to communicate with the database, if the driver required some extra component, are you getting that, okay? So, if the driver required some extra component to communicate with the database, okay? Such type of drivers are called thick drivers, right? Okay? In the case of type 1, type 1 driver internally depends on ODBC driver. Sir, with the help of ODBC driver, it can communicate with the database. Suppose ODBC driver is not there, then type 1 driver can't work. Remember that. I hope I covered in the architecture diagrams in the last uh, examples, right? Same way, if we consider type 2 driver, type 2 driver to communicate with the database, compulsory database vendor provided native libraries compulsory should be there on the client machine otherwise it can't communicate with the database correct right next to type 3 driver to communicate with the database compulsory middleware server must be required so if the driver software required some extra component to communicate with the database such type of drivers are called thick drivers right are you able to understand? Sir, my driver requires some extra component. Then only it can communicate with the database. Such type of drivers are called what? Thick drivers, right? But uh, type 4 driver, it won't require any component, sir. Directly it can communicate with the database. Correct, right? It won't require any component. Type 4 driver, without taking support of any other component, Directly it can communicate with the database. If the driver won't require any extra component to communicate with the database, such a type of driver is called a thin driver, right? Of course, can you give an example for the thin driver, sir? The thin driver type 4 driver, right? Clear for all of it. Sir, can you please repeat once again? What is a thick driver? What is the thin driver? If the driver, if the driver software required some extra component to communicate with the database, such a type of driver is called a thick driver. If the driver software won't require any extra component, directly it can communicate with the database. Such a type of driver is called one thin driver. In the entire room, sometimes maybe a chance of asking what is the meaning of thick driver or what is the meaning of thin driver, which are thick drivers, which are thin drivers, you should be in a position to answer right, okay? Just uh, have a look one, sir. If you consider this is my Java application. Sir, all the drivers are there in front of you. It's a, it's a very helpful, sir. Sir, this is the Java application which internally uses JDBC. This is my database. Observe that. This is itself is my database, right? Now, if it is a type 1 driver, type 1 Java application communicates with the type 1 driver. Type 1 driver communicates with the ODBC driver. 
which is going to communicate with the database are you getting so type 1 driver required odbc driver to communicate with the database that's why this driver is thick driver remember this one because without taking extra component support it can't communicate with the database sir type 1 driver to work compulsory odbc driver must be required are you getting right if the driver required extra component to communicate with the database such a type of driver is called what thick driver clear right same way type 2 driver java application communicates with the type 2 driver type 2 driver internally uses database specific native libraries have you remember right database specific native libraries then which is going to communicate with the database are you getting so type 2 driver require native libraries then only it can communicate with the database that's why this driver is also thick driver right next uh, type 3 driver required middleware server to communicate with the database correct or not sir type 3 driver required middleware server to communicate with the database that's why type 3 driver also thick driver right but uh, if you observe type 4 type 4 driver directly communicate with the database i'm not taking any extra component like odbc driver or database specific native libraries or middleware server this a type 4 driver directly communicate with the database without taking any extra component support that's why this driver is nothing but one thin driver are you in a position to understand right sir which drivers are thick drivers type 1 type 2 type 3 drivers are thick drivers type 4 driver is a thin driver clear right so in the interview room if any person is asking what is the difference between thick driver and a thin driver okay if the database driver requires some extra component to communicate with the database such a type of driver is called a thick driver okay example for the thick driver is type 1 type 2 type 3 if the database won't required if if a driver software won't required any extra component to communicate with the database if the driver directly can communicate with the database such a type of drivers are called thin driver example for the thin driver is a type 4 driver clear right sir may be a chance to ask uh, what is the difference between thick driver and a thin driver or which are thick drivers which are thin drivers i hope it's a clear for all of you right that's all